we just uh, drill it, yeah? So that we... Flexi biogas, as it is fondly called, is made by the use of vegetable market waste, plant weeds, kitchen waste, animal or human waste to produce more gas that provides fuel energy, saves the environment and generates income. His uh, system, as I told you, basically it uses the, the, the human, uh, the, it can use the humans, human waste, it can use the cow dung, it can use the, 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 the kitchen waste, it can use, the, it can use the, the wind. So basically it's a system that is friendly, it can use quite a variety, very versatile not relying on one, one material, yeah. Pressed by the need to come up with better means of producing eco-friendly means of domestic fuel energy, one company after being informed by the passion to contribute positively in the life of ordinary Kenyans has come up with better, easy and non-cumbersome means of providing fuel to households by making use of easily available wastes. Yes, I go and uh, the person who was behind it is called Dominic Onje here. And uh, what necessitated this is um, his, uh, you know, passion for environment. As we know, <coughs> uh, so many, we are using, we are losing so many uh, trees. We are losing so a huge chunk of uh, forest to, uh, to, to charcoal and also to, to firewood. And as we are aware, it's um, the country, the whole of our country, we have a, a forest cover which is less than 4%. So now his concern is if this trend doesn't change, then in the near future, in a very few years, like uh, 20 years or 30 years from now, we won't have any forest cover in the country. So that is um, what we drove him into coming up with a solution. One does not need to be an agricultural biotechnologist to understand the process involved in order to have flowing gas into his or her kitchen. Flexi biogas saves you money. The conventional biogas system is dug in the ground and you have to put a lot of cement and it costs you a lot of money to do that. You use metal pipes for the fittings which rust over time, which also increases the maintenance costs. But if you use flexi biogas, which is made up of canvas and plastic only, you don't have any metal parts. And so there is no rusting of parts. That means that there are no maintenance costs at all. Even with deep interests, it still remains pretty hard for most people living in the urban centers to build a compost pit for production of biogas due to several limiting factors. The new system mocks them all. Heat, which is a catalyst for gas uh, production, you have on the service, the, when it gets hotter, also the system gets hotter, meaning you have more gas production. But in the ground, there is no heat going there meaning even when it is extremely hot, underground, there is nothing which is changing. We are using waste material and making energy out of it. And by so doing, we are going to stop relying on too heavily on fossil fuel. And we are going to start saving our environment. And of course, we'll have a cleaner and greener environment. With the cost of liquefied petroleum gas soaring beyond the reach of many, it is time that we turn to the proper use of the waste around our homes to produce energy that is not only cheap but clean. The materials one needs to supply his household with clean sufficient fuel gas at an affordable price are some of the items that many people wish they disposed first. Basically, all you need now when uh, you are installing this system, you need not to do any construction or you need is just to lay the digester. And uh, the moment you lay it, you load, if it is uh, cow dung, you load it. Then from there, if it is kitchen waste, you load it. And then from there, you give it about uh, seven days for the gas to mature. Then you'll be able to monitor the, the gas development because you can see the change in height with the, with the, with the system or the, the digester. So within after seven days you have your gas and it's ready for use. After insulation, the cost of maintenance is absolutely cheap. With biogas, the only and the highest cost is, maintain, uh, is installation costs. So after you've installed the flexi biogas, you only need any kind of decomposing organic matter. 
for example, kitchen waste, human waste, or even animal waste. So uh, for starters, we are going to take one of the plants from this demonstration farm in Karen, and we will go and install it today. We are very excited about that. I have my team of 74 project members, and I'd just like to encourage everybody who is thinking about using uh, cheaper energy to go the biogas way. The innovation that helps to turn waste into energy producing adventure has generated great enthusiasm from a group of young people. Led by Joyce Wangari, a consultant counseling psychologist, they are not sparing anything on their way to promote their Go Green agenda through distributing and installing flexi biogas. We hope to have people educated about flexi biogas and to have the uptake and utilization of flexi biogas and all the related accessories and byproducts. The reason I am undertaking this community project is to touch, move and inspire the community. I'm doing it as part of a course that I am taking called Landmark Education, where we are coming up with projects to inspire leadership and creativity in the people in Kenya. Flexi gas is really flexible in a lot of sense. Because of the high cost of living, many Kenyans are now seeking alternative sources of energy. And you find that with biogas, you are able to cook, you can light, you can run a biogas generator and produce uh, energy to run even a motorbike. So we would like to open an agency to sell flexi biogas plants to not only the people in Nairobi, but also the people throughout Kenya, Africa and the whole world. Just with a few kilos of biodegradable waste, flexi gas production not only conserves the environment and provides fuel for cooking, it can also be harnessed to provide lighting, drive electric generators and also provide power to many electronic appliances at home. We have just bought the first flexi biogas plant in our agency and when we install it and use it we're going to also market it and we what we want to do is have every energy consumer in Nairobi replace all the charcoal all the firewood and all the LPG with uh, biogas plants. The units are available in different sizes capacities and prices according to individual household needs. Uh, in terms of cost, it's very cheap. The big system that I was telling you, you can uh, use it to run your generator. It costs only 71500 Then the other one for a small family is 58500 And then we have a new system using the polythene, which costs only 15000 So basically, when you come to the gas production, you are insured or you are assured of a more gas production with, uh, with our system. The young entrepreneurs are going a long way to mobilize resources to make available the energy producing units to schools, children's homes and other vital institutions. And this flexi biogas can be used not only in homes but also in schools, churches, institutions of any kind, organizations and we are going to have um, a huge energy saving and we are going to have a blast doing this project I'm sure. <laughs> Yeah. Have you ever imagined that just within the rented space of your area in an urban city, you can actually produce biogas without having to dig a hole and a pit? Flexi Biogas, an innovation from Biogas International, is offering these solutions with wonderful results. Solomon Weary. GBS News.